all right guys welcome back for another duck on battle video and today what we're going to be talking about is finally they have dropped the information over here both on global and jp about what is going to be coming to uh part two of this uh celebration so first of all we want to start out with talking about their awakenings um again hercule and goku are both going to get their awakening so they're going to add new stages to their story event which are more dragon stones for you guys to grind out um Okay, so Hercule becomes a Hercule and Boo card, and then Goku becomes a Super Saiyan 3 card. Of course, we already knew this from the live stream, um, if you guys watch the English version of it. Uh, they're also going to get an easy area, which was expected because last year's units, uh, the Goku and Gohan and the Vegeta and Trunks, also had an easy area. So, there you go, an extreme Z area for those units. Um, I would say that is unfortunate because I would have preferred something like um, a regular easy A so we can get, uh, you know, some really good rewards. Okay, so what else do we have here? We have the Extreme Super Battle Road stages. Um, again, JP got this during Saiyan Day is when I believe they got this. So, again, we finally now have Extreme Super Battle Road. Um, again, if you guys want, I can make a guide to it because um, personally, I'm not going to be able to beat them. But um, I have seen, you know, plenty of other people take it on, kind of talk about what exactly you, you know, what units you really need for Extreme Super Battle Road. So. Um, I'll probably make a little video on it, kind of talking about which units truly are going to dominate when it comes to these stages, and, you know, which stages are, you know, harder than others. And then we also have a new stage of Infinite Dragon Ball History, so again, this is awesome because, um, you know, with this gives you what, I believe it is, like, 20 stones if you complete it the first time, and then there's, like, an extra 10 if you complete all the missions with it. So that is that. Um, I will be playing the animations later on but I uh, Goresh dropped the translations for uh, what's it called the units the uh, Goku and the Boo and Hercule is it this one yes it is okay so Goresh dropped the translations so anyways this is Hercule slash Majin Buu good Leader skill Majin Buu Saga 2 key 50% to stats. Again, this is pre Easy A. Of course, he's going to get his Easy A, uh, but unfortunately, we don't know what exactly his Easy A is going to look like right now. Super Attack, Champion Splendid Dance, raises defense, causes extreme damage, and lowers attack. So, again, he's still a, a defensive stacker. Passive, my vigorous power, medium chance to evade enemies' attacks, probably a 30 to 25% chance, reduces damage. Damage received by 30% when HP of 50% or above. Again, pretty good. Uh, Majin Buu Saga Category Allies 2, key 10% attack and defense. Again, that makes him a much better unit now because he's also a support type unit. Uh, exchange with Majin Buu, good when conditions are met. Exchange to Majin Buu, good during the next attacking turn once damage has been sustained 5 times throughout the course of the battle. Okay, so that's actually not that bad. Link's World Tournament Champion, Champion Strength, Hero, Money, 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 Bravery, Supreme Power, and Shattering the Limit. Categories, Majin Buu Saga, World Tournament, Earthling, and Saviors. Ooh, so I can actually showcase him on the Earthlings. Majin Buu Saga and Tournament, World Tournament. That's actually really good because, again, those are huge buffs to the teams that need them. Um, especially World Tournament and Earthlings. Because, again, Majin Buu Saga, after, you know, the celebration is sitting pretty good. And then... Majin Buu good, this is once he exchanges into him. Super attack, Innocence Cannon, raises attack and defense for one turn, causes supreme damage and lowers attack. Passive, the forking of good and evil. 70% attack and defense, Majin Buu Saga category allies 2 key, attack and defense plus 20%. Links, but shattering the limit changes to Majin, Innocence, Infinite Regeneration, Revival, Master of Magic, and the Wall Standing Tall. Okay, so the Majin Buu's got some pretty good links because he's got infinite regeneration, which is really good. So as well, the wall standing tall once it's level 10. And then obviously Majin is really good. Okay, so this guy's actually pretty solid. And this is, like, again, pretty easy A. So again, this is all going to get buffed. Okay, where is... Oh, okay, here is Goku's. Okay, so again, this Goku's going to have this special super attack mechanic. And I'll show you his animations... Uh, after I'm done with this because they're actually pretty good. I mean, I've I mean, I've already seen them and they're really really nice His leader skill is final trump car category 2 key 50% attack and defense <clears throat> Or in type 2 key 30% super attack Kamehameha Supreme damage and lowers attack passive super saiyan 3 in the flesh 
80% attack and defense, gain an additional attack and defense plus 30%. The higher the HP, the greater the stat boost. Lift transformation when conditions are met. Link's Golden Warrior Super Saiyan Kamehameha over in a flash, limit breaking form, shattering the limit and supreme power. Categories Majin Buu Saga, Pure Saints, Goku's Family, Super Saiyan 3, Kamehameha, and Final Trump Card. And then, what is the... Okay. Okay, it doesn't tell me his, um, the way he transforms, but I know this for sure. Um, it says... No, it doesn't say it, but... Um, you have to be under 80% HP for him to transform back into base, and then you have to have an ally on the same rotation whose name includes Hercule that is in the Majin Buu Saga category in attacking in the same turn so under 80% HP and then yeah Goresh points it out right over here it says that after three turns have passed when HP is 80% or below and again you have to have a Hercule that's from the Majin Buu Saga um, and once you're able to do that it, 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 it unlocks the special super attack mechanic which is the spirit bomb it causes supreme damage, super class allies 20% attack for one turn. Uh, again, this is the super attack that's just him, you know, base Goku. But this is the unit super attack, so this is when uh, both Hercule and Goku are on the rotation. And that's when Goku then is able to uh, use the actual, you know, super spirit bomb. Uh, super spirit bomb causes immense damage, super class allies 20% 20, 20 attack and defense for one turn. Um, passive, everyone's assistance, 80% attack and defense, gain an, ad an additional 20% attack per rainbow key sphere obtained, attacks effective against all types if a rainbow key sphere is collected. Okay, so that's actually pretty good, because again, you can run him with, um, Tech Fat Boo, who creates a lot of tech, uh, or rainbow key spheres. <coughs> also with, um, <coughs> Jesus, with the STR, um, Gohan. The SDR EZA family Kamehameha Gohan also creates rainbow key spheres. Okay, what is going on with my voice right now? <clears throat> Lord. And then Link's Golden Warrior Super Saiyan Kamehameha over in a flash limit breaking form becomes Saiyan Lineage, Saiyan Warrior Race, all in the family, prepare for battle and experienced fighters. So overall, <clears throat> god damn it, these are pretty good uh, units. And again, this is also pretty easy. I want you guys to keep that in mind because that makes a huge difference. And is there anything else? No, it's just then about the super attacks, which I will show you guys. And I don't think there will be audio, just because um, I've actually tried it before and it doesn't work out. But um, I'll, I mean, I'll try to post a separate video with the actual audio in it. So it was up here. Where is it? Oh, right here. Okay, here we go. Full screening, baby. And let's look all the way back at Vominos. Okay, so uh, those were the Super Attack animations, which, by the way, look really, really clean. And I like it when it does this uh, animation. Where is it? Uh, where is it? It's got to be here. <coughs> yeah, right there. Mm -hmm. Right there when it shows you that, uh, you know, you got the partner Super Attack off. Where is it? Let's go back. 
That looks really nice. I like that. And if they keep... I mean... Ooh. I mean, they're just doing it for this unit. Imagine what... And... Okay, wait. So, I know I'm, like, slowing my words and all that, but... Okay, the animations for this are really good, considering this is a free-to-play unit. And this actually got me thinking, what can we expect from the uh, Vegeta? Because it's either going to be a base, like, transforming Vegeta that has an active skill where he gets a buff. Obviously, we know that from Dokkaner. But, again, this is just a free-to-play unit, and this looks really nice. So, ooh, this has got me thinking about, you know, what exactly... Uh, you know, the LR is going to look like if this is what they're doing just for free-to-play unit. So, anyways, guys, that's going to do for today's video. Again, finally, you know, we get some new content. Infinite Dragon Ball History, Super Battle Road, Awakenings, an easy area. Um, actually, uh, I didn't show it in the global version, but here's a big thing. What if I can find the JP one? Where is it? Oh, come on. Is it? No. There's actually something also really big. They're going to give an um, LR EZA to this guy as well. So besides the Hercule, they're also going to give an LR EZA to this guy. Uh, the OG uh, Goku from the, uh, I believe it is, the original Dragon Ball uh, Super Battle Road stages. Uh, they're finally going to give an EZA to this guy. And again, he's like easily one of the best free-to-play you know, leaders that you can run. But um, they're going to make him you know, super good again now because he's going to get an EZA. So again... This was only released on the JP section of the news, so again, you know, I don't know if it'll be coming to global, because again, they didn't announce it in the news. But um, anyways, guys, that's going to do for today's video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.